Lent, a time of preparation. 2 Corinthians 5, 17, 20, and 21 in the New Revised Standard Version says, So if anyone is in Christ, there is a new creation. Everything old has passed away. See, everything has become new. So we are ambassadors for Christ since God is making his appeal through us. We entreat you on behalf of Christ, be reconciled to God. For our sake he made him to be sin who knew no sin, so that in him we might become the righteousness of God. God gave me three principles to share as we prepare for Christ's resurrection during the Lent season. Our first principle is self-reflection. Lent is a time to look at our lives and ask ourselves, are they lined up to what the word calls a new creation in Christ Jesus? Are we really being ambassadors for Christ? Or are we still holding on to weakness of the past that we have refused to give up, even though the Holy Spirit has been nudging us to do so? Lent is a good time to set, diligently seeking God through fasting and prayer about this and make a decision to repent. The second principle is others. Are we lined up with the vision of the church? Are we on the move for God? Are we seeing the manifestation of an open heaven over our brother and sister's life? Lent is just the right time to look at others, struggles, and others facing all kinds of situations. Jesus suffered and died for all mankind, whether they accept him or not. Can we suffer? a little ourselves by fasting for someone else's salvation and deliverance. The final principle that God emphasized is worship. During the 40 days of Lent, we should spend extra time in our day to love on God. Open your Bible. One of my favorite chapters is Psalms 103. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. I make it personal. Thank you, Lord, for forgiving all my iniquities. Thank you, Lord, for healing all my diseases. Thank you, Lord, for redeeming my life from, destru from destruction. Thank you, Lord, for crowning me with your steadfast love and mercy. Thank you, Lord, for satisfying me with good as long as I live so that my youth is renewed like the eagles. So let Lent be a time of self-reflection, prayer for others, and worship to God, who is so worthy to be praised. God bless you.